Good evening. Welcome to our Christmas program, Christmas in the Stable. The children have been working very hard to prepare for this evening. We would appreciate it if everyone would stay seated for the program. Thank you to Chuck Barlin for accompanying the children on the piano. We would like to take this time to introduce Pastor Flader. Thank you for being here tonight. This gives me another wonderful opportunity to thank you families for letting us be a part of your children's lives, to be a part of their education. I was thinking back today, over 25 years ago, our children's first two years of education was as a three-year-old and then a four-year-old in preschool. And we know even today the, the benefit of that and the gift. So we're so glad at Holy Trinity to be able to provide a Christian-based experience for your kids and we just love them, and we're just so glad to be a part of them, and I get to be part of chapel, and that's one of the highlights of my month with your children. Also, you know, we continue to be amazed at our wonderful staff and the longevity of it and how long it's been, so uh, this is also a good chance for us to take a moment and remember Mrs. Jenny and Mrs. Julie and Mrs. Connie and for the wonderful gifts they bring to this program. Shall we thank them before the program begins? <laughs> And in a few days on our webpage and on the Noah's Ark webpage here at the church at HTLCDBQ, the initials of the church and the town.com, there'll be a posting that'll lead you to YouTube for tonight's program if you're inclined. So check that out in a couple of days also. But now it's time. Let's begin our program, Christmas in the Stable. Long ago, Mary and Joseph made a long journey to Bethlehem. They arrived at night in a city asleep and locked up tight. Tired and worn, they could find no room. No room. They could find no room at the inn. Instead, they found a, sh a stable where they could rest. The stable was dark except for a small lantern hanging on the wall. The animals knew that something special was about to happen in their stable. They gathered around as the newborn baby was brought into the world. Mary wrapped the baby in swaddling clothes and laid him in the manger. Shepherds were watching their sheep when angels filled the sky. The angels told the shepherds to gather their sheep and go to a stable in Bethlehem. There they will find a newborn king lying in a manger.
three kings traveled from the far east across the desert to bring the Prince of Peace gifts of myrrh, frankincense, and gold. They knelt down to worship Jesus. By candlelight, quiet and peace settled over the stable. The holy child fell asleep, and the glorious stars blazed their beacon of hope over all. Let's fold our hands and do our December prayer, candle, candle, burning bright. Thank you for attending our special Christmas program. Please join us in the Living Faith Center for cookies and refreshments. The children at Noah's Ark Preschool would like to wish you a Merry Christmas. Welcome, Pastor Flader. Thank you, boys and girls. Could you all have a seat, please? Right where you are, just everybody have a seat. I have something for you. Oh, boy. Okay. I'm going to sit right up here, okay? Thank you. Very well done telling the story of the baby Jesus. Yeah. So our custom around here is to share a little gift of the Christmas season every year. I've been doing this for about 15 years, and in it is a beautiful gift for you to put on your Christmas tree. Cal, you want to hold my mic for me? There you go. Right there. You'll be my mic guy. Okay. He's got it. All right. Good boy. I'm going to show you what's inside of it, and then your teachers will hand you one out as you make your way back to your families. This reminds us of the most important thing of the gift of Christmas, just what you just did, a nativity scene, and Mary and Joseph look a lot like you, I would say, in this one. Okay. So I hope you have this, and I hope you have a blessed Christmas, and remember that it's all about the baby Jesus and how much he loves you. Thank you very much. Now, Mrs. Uh, Julie and Mrs. Jenny will give you one of these on the way back as you make your way to your families. The time now, Mr. Jenny, to make their way back? You have more? Boys and girls, would you stand up? I think if there are families that want to come up and take a picture, we'll stay for just a few minutes. So if you, would, if you want to come up and take a picture, you may do that. And, but then don't take the children just let, yet. Let the ch everyone have a chance to take a few photos. 